The kitten jiggled too much, but I dashed to the window. It was horror. Algebra was the worst. I just to make sure the tallest, fattest, disgusting, idiotic person in the entire world. Gee, she good that. I never thought middle school was so easy. I breezed through sixth and seventh grade with such ease. I got all the music, I commended performance on all five star tests. Then came eighth grade. My dad gave me warnings, many warnings, but I rarely listened. Then a new kid came. His name was Casey Gupta. He was six feet and weighed about 200 pounds. He bullied all the pretty sixth and seventh graders. He, uh, and had kids follow them. Or else he stole the lunch money or homework. His old school was really easy, so he got into algebra. He also was very disgusting. He never closed his mouth while he coughed his face. Whenever he got into trouble with the teachers, he just argued back. Nobody could stop him, not even the principal or even his parents. But the worst in algebra is period. That is right after lunch. That is when he was the most energetic and hyped. The algebra teacher, Mr. Lawrence, had tried to get rid of Casey for failing. To make it worse, he said it's right behind me. Today I came really early so I could get the warm up done before Casey comes. Yes, I did I do succeed. Mr. Warren told us not to make a tower of cards in groups of four. Rashad, Hunter, Abby, and Susie. Jackson, Stefan, Jared, and Richard. Fatna, Kiki, Ashley, and Shreyas. Jimmy, John, and Grace, and Josie. Then she came to our table and said, Adesh, Arya, Sulu, and Casey. No! I can't believe the work with Casey. We're going to come last. I could see Arya and Sulu's face. We couldn't believe it. Even Mr. Lawrence gave us a worried look. He told us in a whisper, be careful. Then all the tools start. We told Casey to do nothing and, and be in the corner. He listened. That's all we did in day one. We got to Hot Star and Day 2 but we barely failed. Day 3 we were determined but kept on failing and needed help. Then all of a sudden Casey comes to us and said, How are you in algebra? You need to make sure the cards are lined up perfectly. And Casey told us we got more success. Mr. Warren said we did a good job. Demons never underestimate someone.